arguing up through long bulbs. Uh, it doesn't look like it was enough flow to, to turn them on, but hopefully it's charging. Oh, no, it's not charging. Here we go. I didn't connect it right. There you go. Again, not enough flow to turn them on, but hopefully it's charging. And I'm going to assume that it's charged up now. And now I'm going to discharge it. And we want to look at how many times the handle turns. Looks like about a quarter. Okay. And we're only going to do one trial because I don't have enough time to do more than one trial. Okay. Now let's do two batteries. Again. Okay, I'm going to wait until the light bulbs go out because there could still be a flow through the light bulbs. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to. I'm going to assume that it's probably done, steady state by now. Okay, now I'm going to discharge. Okay, and again, we're going to count how many turns. So there's one and uh, definitely a half, but not quite three quarters. So maybe, uh, maybe five eighths. So one and five eighths, maybe. Okay, now let's try three batteries. Is it connect? <coughs> the light bulbs are still on, but they're pretty dim, and now it looks like they're out but I'm gonna let it go for a little bit longer because they could still be charging up. I'll get the next battery pack ready. I can only really do three batteries there. All right, that should be charged up. Okay, so now we're going to discharge. That's three batteries. And ready, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, four and a quarter. Four and a quarter turns. All right. Okay, now we're gonna have five cells. Charge it up. Excuse me, not five cells, four cells. Four cells. Light bulbs are still on, very dim, and now it looks like they're out, but I'm gonna let it charge longer. Because there could be a flow through the light bulbs um, because it needs a certain minimum threshold for them to light up, but there could still be a flow and we just can't tell. Okay, I'm gonna assume that it's completely charged up. And now we're going to go ahead and discharge. Count the number of turns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Not quite eight, so seven, more than seven, three quarters. Um, so four, five, six, seven, 
maybe seven, eight. No, it's not quite seven, eight. It's like a sixteenth beyond um, three quarters. Okay, so I'll let you figure out what that is as a decimal. And again, don't trust my counting. Okay, I'm doing all the work here. You need to go back and verify, replay the video or something like that. All right, so now we're going to do five cells. And the light bulbs are out, but I'm going to let it go longer just to make sure. All right, I would think they would be charged up by now. So let's go ahead and discharge. Again, I'm gonna do the best I can to count, but don't rely on my counting here. Uh, you've got a video where I'm doing all the work. You're responsible for going back and verifying. So that means you might have to replay the video. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, uh, so more than 12 and a quarter, uh, maybe a 16th beyond that, maybe. All right. Um, again, I would replay the video just to make sure. Okay, now we're doing the last one with six cells. At the end of this, what you're going to be plotting is the number of turns, which is going to represent the energy stored in the capacitor, versus the number of cells, which represents the the voltage. Okay, the light bulbs are definitely out. They've been out for a little while, but I'm gonna let it go a little longer just to make sure that it's completely charged up. All right, I would think that would be charged up by now. And now I'm gonna go ahead and discharge. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, almost 18. So 17 and maybe seven eighths. Um, so again, you should count because it was going fast in the beginning. You should replay the video. All right, that's it.